Um, hello, my name is Reem Abadi. Uh, today I'm going to talk about a crystal oscillator uh, presented uh, to Dr. Uh, Fadi Shahrouri. So, uh, table of content we have here, introduction, a definition of crystal oscillator, uh, factors affecting the stability of oscillator, and also additional concepts of crystal cutting, quartz crystal modeling, a reactance uh, against the uh, frequency, a quartz crystal oscillator examples with calculation, uh, types of oscillator and their frequency range, also a crystal oven and simulation and conclusion. These days, crystal oscillator are important clock sources in consumer commercial and military products for many years. The demand of crystal oscillator has been increasing due to their high properties, uh, such as high quality, accuracy, and temperature stability specifications. We are also going to define the general theory for accurately analyzing the non-linear behavior of any crystal oscillator circuit. Uh, also, the, the conditions that can affect of crystal oscillator. So this figure shows us a crystal oscillator a circuit diagram. This one kind uh, of crystal oscillator that works on 16 megahertz frequency. So we are going to talk uh, the definition of crystal oscillator. Crystal oscillator basically is an electronic oscillator circuit. Uses a, pi a piezoelectric crystal, a piezoelectric uh, crystal, a commonly used in quartz crystal, to create an electrical signal with very precise frequency, and also known as a frequency selective element. Uh, the crystal mechanically uh, acts as a resonator and its frequency of vibra vibration determine uh, the oscillation frequency. So, a uh, crystal oscillator, the main thing that use that it use a uh, mechanical resonance of vibrating uh, the crystal of piezoelectric material to create uh, the electrical signal with a constant uh, with constant frequency. So we talk about the characteristics of the crystal oscillator. Uh, basically, we have the uh, crystal oscillator, uh, uh, they have a high quality uh, factor. Uh, better temperature stability than a tuned circuits. Uh, and high quality, better uh, tuned, uh, tuned circuits, and a frequency stability, uh, LC or RC oscillators. They are used to stabilize most of radio transmitter and generate the clock signal in computers, uh, computers uh, quartz crystal. So we talk about disadvantages of uh, the crystal oscillator. Our disadvantage is that they are suitable for frequency applications. Just crystal of low fundamental frequencies are not uh, easy to find. And also the frequency of its oscillation cannot be changed applicable. It's not easy to change it and change it. عن الفلكسبيليتي انه احنا نغير فيها هسه في عنا الابلكيشن يوز ان ذا اوسيليتور في عنا اول شيء اللي هو الفيجر هاد بيوضح لنا اللي هو وان ابلكيشن ذات ار يوز ان كريستال اوسيليتور زي ما حكينا بالكمبيوترز او عنا بالمايكرو بروسيسور بالمايكرو بروسيسور از كريستال كلوك uh, um, عنا كمان ابلكيشن اللي هو كمان بالفريكوينسي سينثيزايزر ممكن uh, موجود بالتي في او راديو ترانزميتر uh, في عنا كمان اللي هو انذر تايبس اوف ريسيفرز وفي عنا uh, ممكن انه تكون موجوده بالفريكوينسي جنريترز اللي هم الكاونترز اند سبيكتروميترز اولسو كمان 
آه، اوكي هسه في عنا بانه زي ما بنعرف بانه الاوسيليشن with uh, very stable uh, frequencies are required for communications and instrumentation as well as other electronic system في عنا بانه لازم يكون في عنده انه بيعطينا اللي هم الاستابيلتي بالفريكونسي طيب شو ال uh, what the factors that are affecting the stability of an oscillator uh, في عنا إنه اللي هو ال uh, factors that are limiting the stability of uh, oscillators and uh, how we can build a highly stable frequencies on oscillator في عنا basically أول شيء في عنا ال variation in temperature and also variation in the load so as well as A change to its DC power supply voltage. بتغير عنا إنه هدول من الفاكتورز اللي ممكن تغير عنا stability بال oscillator. هلا the frequency stability of the output signal can be greatly improved by the proper selection of the component used for the resonance feedback circuits, including the amplifier. But we have a limit to the stability that can be obtained from normal LC or RC tank circuits. Also, to obtain اللي هما ال very high level of oscillator stability requires crystal is generally used as the frequency determining device to produce another type of oscillator circuits known as generally يعني known اللي هو اسمه quartz crystal oscillator اللي هو ال XO Uh, then we are going to talk اللي هو piezoelectric effect and uh, يعني مبدأ عمله and the procedure of uh, cutting a crystal as we can see here in the figure. Okay. Uh, when a voltage source is applied to a small thin piece of quartz crystal, it begins to change shape, producing a characteristics known as the piezoelectric uh, piezoelectric effect. The piezoelectric effect is the property of a crystal by which an electric electrical charge اللي هي بتعمل producing لالميكانيكال فورس by changing the shape of a crystal uh, and vice versa. A mechanical force applied the crystal produces an electrical charge. Piezoelectric devices اللي هما they convert اللي هو إيش the main thing أو the main goal they convert the energy of one kind into energy يعني one kind to another اللي هو type of energy from electrical to mechanical or mechanical to electrical energy. So this piezoelectric effect produce a mechanical vibration or oscillation. which can be used to replace the standard LC tank circuits. Okay, the quartz crystal used in quartz crystal oscillator is very small, in كتير صغيرة, with a thin piece of cut quartz with two parallel surfaces, اللي هو عنا two parallel surfaces, metalized to make the, re the required electrical connections. Uh, also, we have the fundamental frequency called in crystal oscillator, which is also called the characteristics of frequency. So, once the crystal is cut and shaped, the crystal cannot be used at any other frequency. يعني مجرد ما إحنا قطعناها أو على limit محدد مش ممكن إنه يعني بيشتغل على frequency محددة. هسا يعني in other world, uh, world its size and shape determines uh, its fundamental oscillation frequency اللي هو based على ال cut, cutting procedure okay the crystal characteristics or characteristics frequency is inversely proportional to its physical thickness between the two metallized surfaces. زي ما حكينا بالمحاضرة بإنه كل ما كان كل ما كان الصاي سبعة أقل كل ما كان التكلفة عندي أكبر الكوست أكثر عندي. Also ال بيكون عنده the quality the crystal بيكون عنا أحسن. Okay, we have here. 
هسه اوكي انه حكينا انه كريستال كاركترستكس فريكونسي از انفيرسلي بروبورشنال تو فيزيكال ثيكنس بيتوين تو ميتالايزد سيرفيسز هير وي هاف ان ذا تيبل بيلو ذا موست كومن كريستال كاتس اند ذير كاركترستكس First of all, the type of cut, اللي هو AT, the frequency اللي بيشتغل عليها اللي هو من 0.5 اللي اللي هو بيكون فيها اللي هو من 0.5 ل 300 megahertz. هسا هو the most it's the most common developed in 1934. The frequency temperature curve اللي هو بيكون as a sign. Sign shaped curved with an inflection point and an inflection between a 25 and 30, a 25 and 20, 35 Celsius. The optimum AT cut uh, with frequency variation, temperature of only uh, plus minus 20 parts per million uh, from minus 50 Celsius to plus 100 Celsius. Most estimated over 90% uh, of all the crystals uh, had a type. The upper limit uh, for the fundamental mode of vibration is around uh, between 30 and 40 megahertz. So the second type, uh, the SC, uh, uh, type of uh, frequency range is uh, between 0.5 and 200 megahertz, uh, like the BT, we're going to talk about ال ال it's a special a cut called stress a compensated a developed in 1974 oscillator. We can have low voice a phase noise and the good characteristics. But compared to AT cut, it has a low sensitive to mechanical stress higher. You know, أحسن منه بإنه مش sensitivity زي إنه أقل منه. Uh, higher speed and the quality factor أعلى, uh, with the frequency temperature uh, curve has an inflection at 0.96 Celsius and the optimum uh, CS, uh, SC a cut has a much lower uh, lower temperature sensitivity than uh, AT زي ما حكينا اللي هو AT cut. Also, the characteristics of the SC cut uh, are much better from between two and th three times of AT cut. Okay, the BT, the uh, BT cut, the BT cut uh, from uh, 0.5 to 200 megahertz. It's similar, who uh, are similar to AT, uh, but عنده اللي هو also, it has a poorer temperature characteristics than AT cut. And compare. Uh, and use for oscillator, who will vibrating at the fundamental mode uh, that is higher than the AT, uh, around the 50 megahertz. Okay. This figure indicates the equivalent electrical circuit for quartz crystal shows a series RLC circuit which represents the mechanical the, me, the mechanical vibration of a crystal in parallel with a capacitance اللي هو S uh, in parallel اللي هو with capacitance عندنا CS وال CP has a CS اللي هو capacitance include the uh, عندنا uh, the friction of the crystal, the S, the CP, which represents the electrical connection to the the crystal. Okay. We're going to talk about the CP. Okay. Quartz crystal oscillator, اللي هما basically هما tend to operate toward their series. Connection, اللي هو series resonance. Series RLC contains the component qualifications. في عندهم مثلاً بيكون قصدي بيكون ال RS ال low valued RS و basically كمان ال SC اللي هي ال friction of crystal راح تكون واطية has 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 a small valued and a large Valued inductor, اللي هو LS. هسا due to the presence 
of SCP. Uh, the crystal will resonate at two different frequencies. So we have, first of all, we have a series resonance frequency, heal FS, which occurs when the series capacitance, which is CS, resonates with the series inductance LS. At this stage, uh, the crystal impedance will be at the, at the least, where the feedback will be the largest. Now, we have a mathematical equation for the series, basically. The second frequency point established as a result of a parallel resonance created when LS and CS resonate with parallel capacitor, which is CP, as shown. Uh, also, the crystal impedance uh, uh, will be the higher, and uh, the feedback will be the series will be feedback at the least. And here we have the mathematical equation. Okay, the slope uh, of crystal impedance above uh, shows that uh, as the frequency increases across its terminals at a particular frequency, the interaction uh, of between the series capacitor was CS and the inductor LS it creates a series. Okay, creates a series resonance circuits, reducing the crystal impedance to a minimum. Here we have the minimum RS hold. This frequency point in school. Uh, is, this frequency point is uh, called the crystal series resonance. Okay, high point, which uh, is frequency series resonance, which is FS, and high point, which is the parallel frequency point. So, uh, frequency FS, which is below FS, will act like a capacitive impedance and as the frequency increases above the series resonance point the crystal behaves like an inductor as we can see here um, until the frequency reaches its parallel a resonance the frequency had the parallel the frequency the whole fs this frequency points this frequency point, uh, uh, the interaction between the series and inductor LS and parallel capacitor CP. CP creates a, a parallel tuned LC tank circuit and uh, such uh, as the impedance uh, across uh, the crystal reach the maximum value. And here are the equations uh, which we are, uh, which I built uh, based on the crystal oscillator. في عنا basically uh, أول شيء في عنا الحكينا إن ال F C اللي هو ال series resonance frequency وال F P اللي هو ال parallel resonance frequency. هسا في عنا بإنه ال ال also اللي هو ال reactance uh, of the uh, capacitors and series impedance and in parallel as well with inductor uh, reactance. As we can see in the upper graph, uh, we talked about the FC and the FP and how it uh, acts like a capacitance or uh, inductor. Uh, also, uh, the crystal will be a capacitor. We conclude that the, uh, the crystal will be a capacitive uh, form when the frequency is outside the FS or FP. The crystal will act like a capacitive when it is outside the FS and the FP. FP points. The quality also, we are talking about the quality factor. We said that the quality factor determines, what is it? It determines the crystal's frequency stability. And here we have the equations that talk about the reactants for the circuits in parallel and in series circuit. And here we have this figure shows the crystal of reactance vs frequency and uh, the, the critical point the series with resonance and frequency resonance. 
series and the parallel resonance, yes. Basically, we have the crystal oscillator can, can be designed by connecting the crystal into the circuit such uh, that uh, the operating uh, crystal oscillator can be used in the series or series resonance mode or the parallel resonance mode or the anti-resonant which operate at a high impedance like we said before. هسا بهاي السيركتس اللي هو الفيجر 1 ار 1 اللي هو الار 1 اند ار 2 الريزيستنس اللي هو موجودين المين فانكشن تبعهم فروم فولتج ديفايدر نتورك وايل ذا اميتر اللي هو الار اي ستابلايزز ذا سيركت اولسو في عندنا اللي هو الاس سي اي سوري اللي هي السي اي هذا الكاباسيتور acts an AC bypass capacitor while the coupling capacitor اللي هو جنب الكريستل هاد اللي هو CC is used to block a DC signal propagation between اللي هو collector and the base اللي هي collector and the base and common emitter transistor and common emitter transistor yes هذا in figure B the capacitor اللي هو C1 and C2 from form the capacitive voltage divider network also زي ما حكينا هون هون R1 and R2 هدول كان نفس الشيء اللي هما capacitive voltage divider in network هسا basically كمان عنا اللي هو RFC اللي هو إيش radio frequency coil in the circuits هذا يعني offers advantage advantages to the circuits اللي provide and provides the DC bias and also provide the DC bias or can protect the circuits output from being affected by the AC signal on the power lines. So when we supply the power to the oscillator, the amplitude of the oscillations in the circuit, and uh, when we supply the power, uh, the amplitude of oscillation in the circuits increases until the point is reached, uh, until the point is reached here. Also, كمان uh, عنا also the non-linearities in the amplifier reduces uh, the loop gain to unity. And in general, the frequency of the crystal oscillator will be fixed to be the crystal's fundamental or characteristics frequency, which will be uh, uh, decided by the physical, the mechanical physical size and the shape of crystal. Um, also, in reaching uh, the steady state, the crystal and the feedback loop uh, highly influences the frequency of the operating server, uh, circuit. So uh, the frequency and uh, will self adjust uh, to facilitate uh, the crystals to present a re reactance to the circuit, such, at, uh, such that uh, the Parkhausen phase requirement is applied. Okay, we are going to examples on the quartz crystal oscillator. We are going to design the quartz crystal oscillator depending on these measurements. Uh, first of all, we have the R1 uh, here uh, equal to 6.8 ohm. وفي عنا اللي هي C1 and C2 C1 اللي هي series capacitor وال C2 رح تكون اللي هي parallel capacitor في عنا اللي هو ال crystal بطالب إنه find the quartz crystal series resonance frequency وال parallel with these available measurements First of all, uh, we find the series uh, uh, resonance frequency uh, uh, Fs اللي تساوي 1 over 2 by uh, square root of LS وال CS اللي هي ال inductor and capacitor uh, series وفي عنا اللي هي C1 L1 and C1 وفي عنا إنه we uh, we find the then we find this in this measurement في عنا إنه بطلع معنا اللي هي منعوض تعويض substitution عادي ال FS equal 9.2 megahertz الكريستال بارلل ريزونس فريكونسي برضه رح يكون متى بصير هذا الشيء لما يكون في عنا اللي هو السي بي ان بارلل مع رح يكون في عنا اللي هي 
لما يكون عندنا السي 2 ان بارلل مع الاندكتور والكاباستور في عندنا انه راح يكون 1 اوفر 2 باي بنعوض اللي هو السيريز اندكتور والبارلل كاباستور والسيريز كاباستور حيطلع معنا البارلل فريكونسي ايكوال 9.23 ميجا هرتز Okay, في عنا another question similar to previous question. في عنا بأن ال R S equal six point four. Also, we are going to design a crystal oscillator with C S equal zero point zero nine nine seven two picofarad. With L S equal two point five four six millihenry. بحكينا إنه if the capacitance across its terminal اللي هو CP is measured at 28.68 picofarad CP زي ما حكينا اللي هو ال parallel capacitor اللي هو هذا C2 في عنا calculate the fundamental oscillating frequency بده ال fundamental frequency اللي هي series resonance frequency وبده ال series بده ال secondary resonance frequency و also بده ال crystal oscillator quality factor هسا first of all we find these measurements زي ال ال examples اللي قبل زي ما حكيت منحوض ال ال series inductor وال capacitor وال parallel inductor وال capacitor بيطلع معانا ال series frequency اللي هي nearly to ten megahertz also ال parallel frequency اللي هي متقاربات على بعض ten megahertz في عنا كمان we find the quality factor based on the reactance لل السيريز الاندكتور رياكتنس ايكوال 2 باي اف ال على الار طبعا الاف اللي هي احنا بنعوض السيريز فريكوانسي لانه حكينا الاندكتور حيكون السيريز بالسيركت في عندنا اللي هو السيريز اندكتور زي ما حكينا هلا بنعوض 2 باي في السيريز الفريكوانسي ريزونس اللي طلعت معانا في الاندكتور برضه في عنا اللي هو منعوض ال R برضو بيطلع معنا ال quality factor ال quality factor equal to 25 كيلو كل ما كان ال quality factor تبع ال crystal oscillator أحسن كل ما كان أفضل وكل ما زي ما حكينا بأنه ال quality factor كل ما زاد عنا بيزيد ال cost تبع ال crystal oscillator علينا بس بيعطيني highly efficient بال بالسيركت هسا زي ما حكينا بانه الفريكونسي اوف اوسيليتر رح تكون نيرلي تو 10 ميجا هرتز هسا حكينا بانه الكواليتي فاكتور هون مبدأه بانه زي ما حكينا قبل بانه ال determines the crystals frequency stability in the circuit So in uh, these are the classification of the oscillator. We ha we have the type of oscillator, and uh, each one have a frequency range used. Uh, first of all, we have uh, audio frequency oscillator operating in 20 hertz to 20 kilohertz, with radio frequency oscillator in uh, 20 kilohertz to 30 megahertz. Uh, also, a very high frequency oscillator with ultra high in uh, 30 megahertz to uh, 300 megahertz. We have to reach 3 gigahertz with uh, high frequency oscillator. Also, with microwave oscillators, uh, the frequency that is operating will be from 3 giga to 3 Uh, 30 gigahertz with millimeter wave oscillator زي ما احنا شايفين اللي هو من 30 gigahertz to 300 gigahertz. The uh, frequency stability represents the variation of output frequency of crystal oscillator due to external conditions زي ما حكينا اللي هي ال coefficients اللي هي ال factors sorry اللي هي uh, like temperature uh, variation um, uh, voltage variation um, output load variation and frequency aging. Uh, also, in the frequency stability is expressed in parts per million. The parts per million can be in parts per billion or can be in parts per billion. Okay, the parts per million in the variation in the uh, hertz will be the frequency of the PPM on 10 to the power 6. 
هسه اللي هي بي بي ام اللي هي بارس بير مليون وان في 10 to the power minus 6 وال frequency equal in variation in hertz يعني إذا بدنا ن... بدنا نثبتها أوكي هسا في ع... حكينا بأن ال parts per million في عنا هون ال parts per million اللي هي ال PBM means 1 over 10 to the power 6 يعني 1 part of each 1 of each 1 nominal frequency يعني parts per million اللي هي 1 over million في عنا هون إكزامبل اللي هي الـ quartz oscillator with output uh, frequency اللي هي 1 ميجا هرتز and frequency stability of 5 uh, parts per million فشو رح يكون عنا الـ variation as simple as it اللي هي الـ 5 parts per million اللي هو 5 في 10 to the power minus 6 في 1 million رح يكون في عنا الـ variation in hertz رح يكون عنا 5 hertz As we can see here الـ The stability tolerance can be expressed as a percentage or frequency of deviation. We have the 0.01 percentage will be equalized to 10 parts per million. We have also the 1 parts per million equal 0.001 percentage. Uh, this uh, PPM measurement uh, and, uh, and the measurement tolerance percentage. Okay. هسا الكريستال اوفن الكريستال اوفن اللي هو في عندنا اللي هو تام عند عندنا اللي هو تمبرتشر كنترول اللي هو تشامبر التشامبر اللي هو زي المضخه شكله يوست تو مينتين ذا كوارتز كريستال ان الكترونيك كريستال اوسيليتر ات ا كونستانت تمبرتشر اللي هو فور ليش فور ستيبيليتي Also, we have this figure, which is the crystal oven inside, which is the HP frequency counter. This frequency counter is like a device to measure the frequency. Also, the oven oscillator, the main goal of it is to improve. الادفانتج اللي عنده كان امبروف ذا تمبرتشر ستيبيليتي اوف كريستال اوسيليتر باي ا فاكتور اوف 10000 ذا تمبرتشر ديبندز الفريكوانسي اوف ان اوسيليتر عندنا اللي هي في عندنا الايكويشن اللي هو التمبرتشر اوف ذا ديبندنس اون ذا فريكوانسي اوف اوسيليتر اوكي في عندنا اللي هو الاف تي ايكوال اف نوت بلس K اللي هو الكونستانت في F نوت في T ماينس T نوت. أوكي في عنا بأن الـ first of all عنا الـ operating frequency temperature operating frequency at temperature T اللي هي الـ الـ FT. أوكي وفي عنا كمان اللي هي الـ operating frequency at reference temperature اللي هو T نوت. وفي عنا constant K اللي هو the constant اللي هو temperature coefficient per degree اللي هو 1 في 10 to the power minus 6 و أوكي رح ناخد هون example هاد الاكزامبل اللي هو بحكي بحكي انه a portable radio transmitter has to op operate at temperature from minus 5 celsius to uh, 35 celsius uh, if the signal is derived from a crystal oscillator with a temperature coefficient of plus 1 uh, parts per million degree celsius and it's transmit at exactly 1 146 ميجا هرتز at 20 سيليسيوس في عنا هون في عنا اللي هي الـ reference temperature find the transmitting frequency at the two extremes of the operating temperature range first of all رح نستخدم هاي المعادلة اللي حكينا عنها في عنا actually عنا two frequencies في عنا الـ minimum frequency اللي هي بتشتغل الـ minimum frequency من على based على الـ Minus five Celsius, and we have the thirty-five Celsius. And reference, we have the reference, we have twenty 
20 سيلسيوس اللي هي الريفرنس تمبرتشر وفيرز اوف اول رح نعوض تعويض مباشر في عندنا اللي هو الاف ماكسيمم رح يكون 146 ميجا هرتز بلس الكونستانت هون رح يكون 1 في 10 to the power minus 6 في الـ operating اللي فريكوينسي عندنا uh, 146 ميجا هرتز ورح يكون في عندنا اللي هو بين ال 35 اللي هي الماكسيموم تمبرتشر ماينس الريفرنس اللي هي رح تكون 20 اولسو uh, كمان في عندنا المينيموم رح تكون من الماينس 5 سيلسيوس وال الريفرنس تمبرتشر نفس الشيء في عندنا 20 سلسيس. رح يطلع معنا تقريبا القيم المتقاربة رح تكون ال F maximum equal 146 ميجا هرتز uh, on the other hand في عندنا ال F minimum اللي هي ال frequency minimum equal 145.9 nearly to 146 ميجا هرتز So uh, in this uh, simulation, uh, we are uh, having, you know, we are uh, designing uh, this circuit based on a crystal oscillator in series. Fiana using a multisim. Fiana, uh, this uh, practical simulation uh, at uh, R1 equal one kilo ohm will one. الR3 والR1 1 كيلو أوم uh, في عنا كمان السويتش وفي عنا الترانزيستور وهدول الVCC supply the circuit وفي عنا كمان هدول الريزيستنس حكينا بالسلادات اللي قبل لما يعني المين فنكشن اللي هو بالفولتج ديفيجن أو الستر اللي حكيت عنهم اوكي في حكينا بانه لما حطينا ال R1 وال R3 وال R1 حكينا بال for the voltage division بال بالسيركت في عنا انه this figure shows وفي عنا هون السويتش السويتش كان open فلما كان السويتش open ال output بالاوسيلسكوب طلع معنا بهذا السيجنال it's يعني result when the switch اللي هو ال S P S T is open Uh, once we close the uh, switch, the the circuits can produce a resonance frequency based on the crystal oscillator. يعني أول شيء بعديها بس إمنا رجعنا ال ال when we open again the switch. The signal زي كأنها صار في عنا اللي هو as DC offset. ارتفعت شوي لفوق. اوكي؟ لما ستيب 2 لما فتحنا السويتش. اكشلي في عنا كمان غيرت شوي بقيم اللي هو اللي هون R3 and R1 خليتهم 4.7 كيلو اوم بيزد على ميجرمنت سم ميجرمنت اللي هي حكينا اللي هي الفولتج ديفيجن طلعت معي السيجنال فيها يعني بيرفكتلي ما فيهاش اني ديستورشن او اني اوفست سو هيك. So R1 and R3, we vary it to 4.7 kilo ohm. So in this project, we learned that crystal oscillators are used in many areas of electronics. Using a crystal oscillator circuits enable a high performance, a high stability oscillator to be built very cheaply and easily. بشكل عام الاوسيلاترز ممكن يعني نشوف المشاكل انها ممكن تكون مور كوست بس بتعطيني مور افشنت زي ما حكينا بس يعني احنا بنحاول قدر الامكان بانه نقلل هذا الكوست Also, we learned the basic model of designing a crystal oscillator and the frequency range operated كمان احنا اخذنا اللي هو type of crystal اللي هو crystal oven والmain function اللي بعملها وبرضه اخذنا كمان السيميوليشن شفنا السيميوليشن 
based on multi-sample crystal oscillator in series. Uh, we discuss the main advantage and disadvantage of the oscillator. We uh, take the classification of crystal oscillator and uh, configuration or analysis. Uh, also, crystal oscillator can be used in a large number of applications uh, in electronics, uh, and radio. In some instances, crystal oscillator may be used to provide cheap clock signal uh, for use in digital or uh, logic circuits. So, in other instances, a crystal oscillator may be used to provide a stable and accurate radio frequency signal source. Um, uh, as uh, word document, uh, as a result, the uh, crystal uh, oscillator uh, uh, often used in um, radio transmitter circuits, where they can where they can be particularly uh, effective. I hope in the uh, presentation can move it. Thank you. And these are the references.